Hey guys, Sean with American Window Concepts. Today, let's talk about how tinting your dual pane windows can destroy them. Okay, so here I have two pieces of glass panels, right? So this one right here is gonna be a dual pane glass unit, and this here is a single piece of glass. Now, whenever you're tinting a single piece of glass, I am all for it. This is gonna be something that's gonna have no issue. You gotta replace the tint every, I don't know, five to 10 years or so because it'll start bubbling and getting kind of foggy looking or whatever, but that's an easy fix, right? Tear off the old, put on the new, and that's gonna be your best bet. Dual pane glass unit, not so much. So you have your low E coating on the outside, and that's outside the interior pane of glass is the clear pane. So as heat is coming through this glass, it's making its way slowly through the center and then ultimately starting to warm this. Now, if you've gotten a window replaced and it's on the south side of your house and the low E coating maybe isn't all that strong, it's kind of strong, but it's not that strong. And you're like, you know what? I need something else to kind of boost the power of this you know, window. So you roll some tent on there. Here's what's gonna happen. You are now stopping that transfer of heat through your clear glass and you're creating a, what they call is a heat pocket between the two panes of glass. As that heat pocket gets warmer and warmer on the inside, it is pushing, right, on your spacer. And it's pushing hard and consistently and as it gets hotter and hotter, it continues to push because it doesn't have a way to radiate. When it cools down, all of that hot air begins to cool and continue to cool. What ends up happening is that pressure being pushed on the spacer transfers into more of a suction, right? Now it's pulling up on that spacer into the glass panel area. What's gonna happen is, is that seal is going to lose its stick onto the glass and it's gonna create a seal failure. Fog will form between the panes, maybe some discoloration on the low E coating itself, and it happens quick. The other problem is if you do have a window warranty and the technicians come out and they see tint on your window and you're like, oh, we got a seal failure. So they may or may not, you know, warrant it. They may not give you the, the green light on the claim for your seal failure, which in normal circumstances, they would say, yeah, no problem. We're gonna replace that dual pane glass unit because that shouldn't happen. Whether or not you have low E is besides the point. You're still creating that issue. It's not gonna be as severe as if you have a low E coating because that's gonna create the heat pocket. Hopefully this helps you understand the difference between a single piece of glass with tint and a dual pane glass unit with tint. Hopefully you find this video helpful. Any questions, let me know. Otherwise, make it a great day. Hey guys, if you live in the Ventura or Long Beach area and are interested in a free in-home estimate, go to our website, AmericanWindowConcepts.com and we'll reach back out to you as soon as possible. If you guys find this information valuable and you wanna to continue to learn more about windows and doors, subscribe to our channel. Thank you so much.